you've finished all your edits and now you want to see how things look or you just want to take a look at a piece of something that has particularly complicated parts what do you do well you can do the old shift B which forces a RAM render that's a good start if we have a section in our project, we're not really sure just how it's going to look because of the previewing aspect of things. We want to render that particular piece of the file by itself. Tools, selectively pre-render video. Vegas will use the default project settings unless we override here. And Vegas will basically write this file to the hard drive. Rendering Vegas pre-rendered video file 0000.avi. Now that section has been rendered. We could go through our project file and render sections that we needed to see, and we'd have a hard drive littered with little files. When we do our final render, we're not going to need those files. We can clean up pre-rendered video also from the tools menu. Delete inactive pre-rendered video, all pre-rendered video, or active within the time selection. Now that file is gone. One feature I use frequently is the render to new track feature. I use it mostly with audio, but it can be used with video as well. Here's how I use it. I'll select an audio track and I'll solo it this track right here, my dialogue track. Tools, render to a new track. Since my existing track is 4416 mono, and I don't wish to convert it at this time, I'm going to leave it in that format. Vegas writes the file and inserts it into the track list. At this point, I can right click this file, open it in SoundForge, or open a copy in SoundForge. Even better, I can make whatever changes I want here. Let's just say I take it down a dB, the entire file, and then save it. Now when I come back into Vegas, if I click on this clip, you'll note if I hit the T key, I'm cycling through the different takes. Gives you enormous creative control over your audio files by writing it to a new track. You can do the same thing with video. And Vegas will render that portion of that track to a new track.